I can't wait to see the courtyard again. Damn it! Well, isn't it wonderful? We trudge through this sprawling barrow, face mortal peril every turn, solve deadly puzzles, and what reward awaits us? A scrap of paper with someone's scrawls? What a fascinating learning experience. And the worst part is, why not just send a note like any sane person would? Why make us plod through the whole damn tomb? Did they think it'd be funny? Or was it some kind of test? <sighs> I guess you're right. Sorry about that. I know you're just trying to help. Thanks. Let's get moving then. Oh, what is it? Oh, you're sweet. I'll take you up on that offer after we finish up here. I can't wait to see the courtyard again. I will purify the world for Mirak's return! The rightful dragonborn comes soon. For Mirak! I will purify the world for Mirak's return! You won't win! Mirak! You. Are you all right? That was a close one. I didn't expect to be jumped on like that. And those ridiculous masks they wore. Very tacky. Good to know that cultists will always be the same, no matter what era. Could I read that note you've been reading? Thanks. Hmm. I recall an old book about this cult in the castle's library. This Mirak, though. I've read some stories about him. He was supposed to be the first dragonborn who ever lived. He was around long before even I was. This might be worth looking into. I don't have the faintest idea. Well, they might be someone from Riverwood. Or they might be from somewhere else. They might be luring us into a trap for all we know. I've heard stories of people being abducted in inns. Sometimes the innkeepers even collaborate with the perpetrators. I'm just saying to keep your guard up. Be ready for anything. And if the situation does go south, find the horn as soon as we can and get out of there. If these guys really turn out to be our friends though, then good. It would always be nice to have more allies, especially during these turbulent times. Yeah, it would. No. A pint. It means so much to us to have the claw Barkeep. back where it belongs. I'd like a Thank you. You're asking for trouble walking around with dangerous magic uh, like that. <laughs> I'd like a drink. Of course. Thanks. Don't to swag to swagger to anyone. You're that visitor the poking around. He had made. I'm the innkeeper. But then he it's my quiet attic room, eh? Well, else. we don't have an attic room. But you can have the one on the left. Make yourself What can I do for you? I hope you now like I think it. It's high time that you lie down and bleed. We don't get a lot of travelers here in Riverwood. Yes? What did you need? And the braggart named Ragnar was boastful no more When his ugly red head rolled around on the floor Nice outfit. At least you'll keep up. 
So you're the Dragonborn I've been hearing so much about. I think you're looking for this. We need to talk. Follow me. Close the door. Now we can talk. So, what's on your mind? I can't wait to see the courtyard again. The Greybeards seem to think you're the Dragonborn. I hope they're right. Surprise. I guess I'm getting pretty good at my harmless innkeeper act. I didn't go to all this trouble on a whim. I needed to make sure it wasn't a Thalmor trap. I am not your enemy. I already gave you the horn. I'm actually trying to help you. I just need you to hear me out. Like I said in my note, I've heard that you might be dragonborn. I'm part of a group that's been looking for you. Well, someone like you, for a very long time. If you really are dragonborn, that is. Before I tell you any more, I need to make sure I can trust you. I knew the Greybeards would send you there if they thought you were dragonborn. They're nothing if not predictable. When you showed up here, I knew you were the one the Greybeard sent, and not some Thalmor plant. <coughs> we remember what most don't, that the Dragonborn is the ultimate dragon slayer. You're the only one that can kill a dragon permanently by devouring its soul. Can you do it? Can you devour a dragon's soul? Good and you'll have a chance to prove it to me soon enough. Dragons aren't just coming back. They're coming back to life. They weren't gone somewhere for all these years. They were dead, killed off centuries ago by my predecessors. Now something's happening to bring them back to life, and I need you to help me stop it. <laughs> a few years ago, I said almost the same thing to a colleague of mine. Well, it turned out he was right and I was wrong. I know they are. I visited their ancient burial mounds and found them empty, and I figured out where the next one will come back to life. We're going to go there, and you're going to kill that dragon. If we succeed, I'll tell you anything you want to know. You should know. You got the map for me from Bleak Falls Barrow. The Dragonstone was a map of ancient dragon burial sites. I've looked at which ones are now empty. The pattern is pretty clear. It seems to be spreading from the southeast, down in the Geralds near Rifton. The one at Kynesgrove is next, if the pattern holds. Kynesgrove. There's an ancient dragon burial near there. If we can get there before it happens, maybe we'll learn how to stop it. I need to get into my traveling gear. Give me a minute and I'll be ready. So, what do you want to talk about? I can't That's wait better. to see the courtyard Let's get again. on the road to Kynesgrove. Hey, even I can get tired every now and then. Finally, a place to just relax. Oh, what is it? <sighs> I could use some rest from all the adventuring. It's good to finally have a bed to sleep in, not just a bedroom. Beds. Beds feel so good. Down with Ulfric, the killer of kings. On the day of your death, we will drink and we'll sing. The children of Skyrim, and we fight all our lives. And when Southern Guard beckons, every one of us dies.
But this land is ours, and we'll see it wiped clean of the scourge that has sullied. So, it turns out this friend was none other than Delphine. That's a relief. And she's one of the good guys. I like that. Kind of not cool for her to steal the horn and all that. But, hey, I'm all right with it now. What matters is that she doesn't harbor any evil or malicious intentions. Yes, she might be a bit prickly, but I think it'll be nice to have her on our side. Now, I think we should get going. A dragon coming back from the dead seems like a pretty big deal, to say the least. That spell looks dangerous. Keep your distance. No, you don't up. want to go up there. Especially a dragon. It's attacking. Out. It flew over the town and landed on the old dragon burial mound. I don't know what it's doing up there, but I'm not waiting around to find out. Steady. I don't know what's happening. Let's watch and wait. This is worse than I thought. And now I'm a blooded vampire. Whoa. Yes? What did you need? I'm no fan of the sun, but it would be better than this. You do not even know our tongue, do you? Such arrogance. To dare take for yourself the name of Dova. Zaluganir, Kredar Jur. I'm calling it. This one's in the bag. I am Salukanir. Hear my voice and despair. Your voice is strong for a poor. Do him, Seleko Sabanda. Your voice is strong for a mortal.
honestly think you stand a chance? Not bad, but it won't stay. My voice has been. Enough out of you. <clears throat> yes, what did you need? Whoa, you're actually are you all right? I'm glad you're here. Oh, what is it? This is lovely. I'm one of the last members of the Blades. A very long time ago, the Blades were Dragon Slayers and we served the Dragonborn, oh, the greatest Dragon Slayer. For the last 200 years since the last Dragonborn Emperor, the Blades have been searching for a purpose. Now that dragons are coming back, our purpose is clear again. We need to stop them. The first thing we need to do is figure out who's behind the dragons. The Thalmor are our best lead. If they aren't involved, they'll know who is. Nothing solid yet. But my gut tells me it can't be anybody else. The Empire had captured Ulfric. The war was basically over. Then a dragon attacks, Ulfric escapes, and the war is back on. And now the dragons are attacking everywhere, indiscriminately. Skyrim is weakened. The Empire is weakened. Who else gains from that but the Thalmor? If we could get into the Thalmor Embassy, it's the center of their operations in Skyrim. The problem is that place is locked up tighter than a miser's purse. They could teach me a few things about paranoia. Hmm, I'm not sure yet. I have a few ideas, but I'll need some time to pull things together. Meet me back in Riverwood. If I'm not back when you get there, wait for me. I shouldn't be long. Keep an eye on the sky. This is only going to get worse.